All right, so here we go with the start of round one. I can tell how excited you are for this matchup. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but maybe not. This is a big time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is gonna be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big time athletes? Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the foul. He lands a switch knee. Nice strike. Joyce uppercut is blocked. Looked like for a minute he had a window there and closed quickly. All right, first round is underway here. We say in mixed martial arts, it's one thing to have the reach advantage. It's another thing to use it. We'll see if he can get that jab going to He has got to fight tall. He's got to stay at range, use his length to give his opponent problems, trying to bring the fight into a closer distance. Joy gets the tight clinch here. Nice kick there by Edwards. Big leg kick lands. Whiffs on that offering. Nice job by Leon Edwards going to the kicking game now. Certainly earned the respect with his hands. Now changes the level. Full on mixed martial arts. Yeah. He can do it all. He's a fantastic striker. A guy that can mix it up. A guy that knows exactly where the opening is and isn't shy to take that open. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very good. Edwards gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Powerful leg kick land. Now he engages in a Muay Thai clinch. You better protect that head. Great job securing the Muay Thai clinch. Watch for big knees to the body, and eventually him switch it up with a big knee to the head. All 25 total strikes have landed for Leon Edwards. The Korean Superboy gets hit with a kick. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Edwards. He blocks the shot. And there comes the separation now. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Just over two minutes to go in the round. Hands higher, hands higher. Big clutch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Oh, nice job to defend the takedown and spread it to his feet. Lunges forward with a left there. That shot blocked by Edwards. Oh, beautiful jab there from Leon Edwards. And if you don't know the name Leon Edwards, you're gonna start to hear his name increasingly. Truly one of the better fighters in this division. Absolutely. And the reason you don't know his name is because he's more of a quiet guy. He's very reserved. He used to be at AKA for months, and you barely knew that Rocky was even there. He was just there to get his work in as he's doing his work now inside the octagon. Just missed with that right hand. He is all about that left kick to the body. Effective strike there by Choi. Oh, and he gets tagged. Nice combination there. It might not be a bad idea for the opposition to just tweak that head off the yeah. center line. He was landing one before. Now he's throwing everything in combination, and they're all landing. Blocks the shot. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. And they separate. Boy, Thai Plum. Well, we talked about his reach advantage off the top. Made good use of it there with that punch, DC. They continue to exchange. Big call for West Land. Now he gets back to range. Just missing on the high kick there. I mean, this guy is really focused on those punches to the head inside of the clinch. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. 
Oh, beautiful jab there, man. It's like you know what's coming, can't stop it. I mean, you have to anticipate that jab coming or he will batter and bruise you with that single strike. Five minutes in the books. All right, now we check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. How about the display of striking? Just high level. I mean, you would think that we're watching a K-1 level kickboxing match opposed to being in the UFC. Both displayed great technical skills, unbelievable striking. All right, here we go with round two. Round one, pretty good, not great, but some action on both sides. We can't always hope for fireworks, John. Yeah. Sometimes you gotta deal with the ebbs and flows of the fight. In round number one, you saw both guys have success. Let's see who really charges out ahead in the second round. Big kick. Oh, another strike to the body. Not a lot of real estate there, but he found it. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. Nice, great punch. Going to the body now with the kick. That one is blocked, though, by him. Single collar tie now, and they separate. Oh, and he got tagged by that combination. His coach said on Thursday to us, it has to be punches and bunches. It has to be volume. And his student has certainly followed up on that apparently. So much volume, but the accuracy, the accuracy of this fighter is truly unbelievable. Punch over the top. Oh, he got a real good too. Well, he continues to stay busy. What do they say, DC? Punches in bunches? Punches and bunches. He's landing them upside his opponent's head over and over again. Look at him yank the head and land that beautiful punch in the clinch. Try to establish that jab. Edwards is lower. John now starting to show signs of swelling. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Look at that switch knee. Beautiful switch knee. Nice punch by Evans. And yet again, finding the right distance and range and landing another punch. He's got a decided reach advantage in this one. Real quick leg kick. That strike blocked by Edwards. Oh, that is a nice straight punch by him there. He's got it all going tonight. No. Ooh. He's got hurt here. Oh, he might be out. Oh, big elbow. Oh, another punch to the head. He has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may flow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Effective punch there by the Korean Super Bowl. And forth we go! Oh! And just like that, the fight is over! Oh my goodness! Yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So, back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. All right, DC, no Telestrator tonight, but we're gonna get you some highlights from this one. This was a fight that had it all, and for my money, his best performance to date. His best performance to date in the biggest moment. In the biggest moments, you gotta show up. And that's exactly what he did tonight. He used every bit of his skill to get the job done.
Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 30 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, the Korean Super Bowl, Du Ha So the celebration is on with him and his team, and rightfully so. A monumental result tonight as he gets the win by knockout. He spoke it into existence. He said over and over to anyone that'll listen, I am going to knock this man out. He did it in an even more impressive fashion than he ever could have imagined.